This is a video shared by Dr. Flavio Lopes from Feira de Santana, Brazil. In this video, we discuss the role of a sarcoidal band with vitreo retinal surgery in cases of giant retinal tear. Some surgeons prefer placing a scleral buckle to support the vitreous base and reduce the risk of a recurrent retinal detachment in cases of giant retinal tear. However, studies show that success rate is not reduced by placing the buccal in these cases. So, placing an encircling band before vitrectomy surgery in giant retinal tear is optional. The key point is to use a wide-angle system and perform a radical base removal. Giant retinal tear are usually associated with a total PVD and the vitreous removal is an easy step in the surgery. The flaps tends to be mobile and the care should be taken to prevent accidental and unnecessary bites on the retina. You can keep the flap down with perfluorocarbon liquid bubble to perform a radical incision of the vitreous base. The anterior retinal flap to which the vitreous is adherent should be excised as much as possible. If the same is left behind, it can get fibrosed and also exert attraction on the ciliary body. We recommend place a buckle if you aren't able to perform lens removal and IOL placement in the same time. Another situation that an encircling band may be necessary is in the cases with PVR, 